Uh, you know, I love to see these old people. There was a guy, there was two men here, yeah, they were in this old yellow car. Uh, I assume it's made by Ford or Mercedes. No, nah, it's most likely Mercedes. I mean, it had two middle front lights. And you know that sh square shape that old cars usually have? Like, less rounded and old school. And the engine was very loud. It sounded like a V8. It sounded like a V8. I respect these people that, you know, get these bad boys out and take them for a spin and just enjoy them. Let them spread their legs a bit more. You know. And they try their hardest to make these cars live on as much as they can. I respect that. Even these old buses that pe people preserve, these old route masters, you see about sometimes. Like, it takes a lot to like keep something that old to like to its like proper state, like it was new. Do you get me? I respect how hard they try, and they do a great job at it. You know the like the actually no 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 I'm not gonna say. It. Well, yeah, man, even when you see these, like, when you look at these old cars sometimes, you rarely see them. Sometimes you see them occasionally. But, you know, when you see these old cars, like, you're like, look how far this, this like, world has came, where the design has totally shifted. Even as these cars go past you right now, you can see the design as it shifted. Like, the design idea as it shifted like when you look at these different cars of all different ages you can see the design like okay like these two coming here they're like the same like relatively the same like design like uh, like relatively the, the same idea of design this one's slightly older this one's like it's kind of modern it's kind of modern perspective this one's kind of like old older this one's old as well, same category as that Peugeot. This one's kind of like a bit more, a bit more modern. And then the one behind the blue car, that one's a bit on the modern side. But it, like, it's nice to see how far like society has came with like the designs. But I'll be real, yeah. As much as I hate Tesla, their car designs are actually iconic WS53 now that thing's got some axles I might have to check that thing out I'm not gonna lie I I'll see what I can do I'll see what I can do Being a hundred percent real, yeah. Dame low. The engine on street lights that some use, it doesn't sound like a. It doesn't sound like a bus engine. It sounds like a car engine. It sounds like it literally sounds like a car engine. A lie, I'm not bugging. Daimler sounds like an engine for cars. I've heard that engine in a car before. I swear down, like, the similar tune, the similar vibration, like, okay, maybe the, es the engine piston's clicking, not really, but, the other thing that goes, like, the, 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 the flipping sound the engine makes, as it throttles, or when it's on, I when, the I when the engine's on idle, the, the clicking sound you hear it in most engines I mean it's okay so basically what that's called what that basically is is that that's the engine pistons you hear that in most engines because every engine uses pistons to power it you get me a part of what's used to power the engine basically the pistons they're inside the engine compartment, the box that's covering it. 
right under the bonnet, yeah, there's a box that's covering the main engine. And then if you take that off, you see the pistons moving about. This is WS60. It is.
how do hail them rides work, bro? The drivers just stop anywhere, but when it's elderly people, they just stop for them. gonna stop literally right here for these people in it so random 